10 years ago, work began across the country on the most complex defence project ever undertaken in Australia, our air warfare destroyers. Over the past decade, more than 5,000 skilled Australians have constructed all three air warfare destroyers, whilst also creating a new combat system and support system that meet the unique needs of the Australian Defence Force. The AWD Alliance has brought together AAC Shipbuilding, Raytheon Australia, Navantia and the Commonwealth to deliver the most technically advanced and formidable warship the Navy will have operated to date. With the delivery of Hobart to Defence, Australia is one step closer to possessing our most interoperable and lethal weapon system yet, as this first-of-class ship will allow Australia to work more closely with our allies than ever before. Hobart successfully completed its sea trials in March 2017. This involved not only testing out the platform system, but also the advanced combat system. The sea trials represented the first time the combat system had been brought together as one complete combat system. The combat system has been architected by Australians for Australian requirements. The combat system is based around the Aegis core weapon system, but incorporates a range of other sensors, systems and weapons to provide a full capability. Impressively, this worked the first time as designed and built. This is a great testament to the hard work of the entire team involved. When they begin entering service from this year, the air warfare destroyers will be large, fast and manoeuvrable warships, equipped with gas turbine and diesel propulsion engines, capable of an operational range of over 9,000 kilometres. Together, defence and industry have worked in unison to build this highly skilled workforce and capability from the ground up. With more than 60% Australian industry content, this program is a true example of how industry can act as a fundamental input into capability for defence. There have been many lessons learned over the last 10 years. Hobart's been a trailblazer for this program. An enormous amount of expertise has been developed throughout this program. This expertise is fundamental to furthering the Navy's capabilities, now and into the future. This completion represents millions of hours of effort over many years, and it's a symbol of the dedication and commitment of our teams. The delivery of Hobart is simply the first step in a legacy of national significance, of which we can all be proud.